Namaste and good morning. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's, it's a great pleasure to welcome you all on this full day event. Uh, it's a special event for AMA, that is the FinTech Conclave. And under the auspices of the BH Jaju AMA Center for Entrepreneurship in IT at the Ahmedabad Management Association. I extend a very well, well welcome to Professor Jaju, uh, Mr. Kriti Shah, and all the distinguished speakers, you know, that include, some of them are not here, they'll be reaching, Mr. Vishal Mehta, Mr. Ankit Ratan, Mr. Unmesh Parthiwala, Mr. B. Uh, Sambhav Murthy, Mr. Vishal Karvati, and Mr. Pratik Agarwal. They represent a large spectrum of the ecosystem like banks, uh, fintech companies, uh, regulators, <coughs> financial infrastructure providers, and so on. Uh, I mentioned about the center, that's the B.H. Jaju AMS Center for Entrepreneurship in IT. This was established by Dr. Jaju uh, with an uh, endowment, who is a former professor of the IIM Ahmedabad. And the center offers various courses in IT entrepreneurship, seminars, conferences, and we have an annual uh, event for the uh, best IT entrepreneur uh, in Gujarat also. And I'm really thankful to Professor Jaju, you know, not only for setting up and nurturing the center, but taking all the pains, you know, since the last two months in, you know, uh, I'll say curating this event and getting all the esteemed speakers for us, you know. And uh, financial technology, FinTech, basically, is an industry composed of companies they use technology to offer financial services. These companies operate in payments, insurance, asset management, and numerous other industries. FinTech has emerged as a relatively new industry in India in the past few years. The Indian market has witnessed massive investments in various sectors adopting FinTech, which has been driven partly by the robust and effective government reforms that are pushing the countries towards a digital economy. It has also been aided by growing internet and smartphone, smartphone penetration, leading to the adoption of digital technologies and rise in the fintech in the industries. India is one of the largest and fastest growing fintech ecosystems in the world. Interestingly, India is one of those countries, basically, that uh, uh, the internet has penetrated more through the mobile, you know. Elsewhere, it's more through the broadband or, or internet connections. But in, interestingly, India, when the cheap mobiles came, the data came cheaper. We have the cheapest data in the world, as you know. You know for many countries, it's a luxury to have that 1.5 or 2 GB per day, you know, absolutely. So interestingly, though, though it has been through mobile, still the, this whole concept has moved up. And uh, uh, as many of you know, India is also the pioneer of many of the concepts which are very unique to the world, like UPI itself or mobile wallets. Like I remember many years ago, I think it was one of the Airtel or somebody who started at M-Pesa in Kenya. Uh, a smart way where the banking was not there, but for sending money, people working, sending money at home, you know, that way. So what we have, our mobile wallet. So that's our great contribution. And anyway, we will listen to all that from the experts. I will not take much of your time. And uh, today's sessions, I'm sure all these uh, sessions encompassing different areas of the FinTech system, it will be a great takeaway. And I'm very happy to see a lot of students today. Uh, it will be a great takeaway. And before I hand it over to Professor Jaju for his opening remarks, I'll welcome Professor Jaju and then Shitej uh, with a memento.
Thank you. He is going to coordinate today's today's uh, event session by session. So thank you, Professor Jaju and Mr. Sadesh. And I think I'll hand over to Professor Jaju for his opening remarks. Thank you.